So hello everybody, in today's video I'm going to show you how to get your own color picker for a Power BI that you can actually use elsewhere. So let's get started. Okay, so one of the things I really, really, really miss in Power BI is a color picker. So you have, you know, have you actually improved the color palette thing? But the thing that is missing that I really desperately need is a night rubber. So I've been looking elsewhere. There are tools that you can install, but I want to have something that is native, native to Windows. So I found these Power Toys. So Power Toys is an extension that you can have. It's just built by Microsoft, so you can just download it on your computer, and it will give you, among other things, a color picker. I'm going to show you other things that you can get also with these Power Toys, but the thing that got me most excited is actually a color picker. So you go to docs.microsoft.com. And then Power Toys, I'll post the link down below. And then you just install from here. They will take you to GitHub page. And on the GitHub page, there is a um, download here. So you just click on it and download it. So once you download it, you'll go to the Power Tray. And there's an icon there. You click on it. And it will open the color picker uh, setting. Some of the things you need to run as an administrator, but the color picker is not one of them. I have changed the uh, shortcut behavior for it. I have control C. You will probably see control shift C, I think. So this is how it works. It's so, so cool. So if I have here, for example, this report and I want to grab this color to put it in here. So often you have to go in here on the formatting pane, try to find the color, copy paste. It's a mess. So if you now click Control C, it will activate this color picker. You can just click on the color you want, and then it will give you the different options. Power BI uses hex, so you copy there, close it, and then you just go to the format pane, more colors, paste it, and then you're good to go. How cool is this? And obviously this Control C works anywhere, on the web, on any Windows program, absolutely anywhere. Now, there are other tools that I think was quite cool with this power tool. You have these fancy zones, so you can split the screen in different ways. For example, if you're using your um, display for having the, like different dashboards or things, that could be actually quite cool. Let me show you. So you have this uh, editor where you can say how you would like to split your screens, and then you can have like different Power BI elements in there, for example. That could be quite a cool thing. I have just the simple split one, just because sometimes I have an extended tool and it just won't snap. That, that's the reason why I'm using this thing. Then you have a, a uh, file explorer add-on, so you can actually visualize SVGs and markdowns. You have an image resizer, so you can right-click and resize without having any editor program. You can change the keyword, the, you know, the shortcuts on your keyword. You can power rename, that means you can pick a few files and bulk rename. So like find and replace kind of thing for file names, super cool. Then uh, you have this one is actually, no that one, this is quite cool. If I, click, if I click Alt Space, it will bring this search experience and then I can find software on my Windows. Obviously you have also the Windows and then it will pop up, you know, this experience, but I actually like this a lot better. And the research results are actually better. So for example, if I look Photoshop, you see, and then here you can just go and open it, run it as administrator, it's really, really good. So make sure you go to Power Toys, download it, ask your administrator to download it. It's a Windows program if you're not able to, and enjoy, enjoy, and rejoice. This is so cool. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow with a particular video on Crippled Data Live channel. Otherwise, I'll see you on Friday. No, on Thursday. <laughs> Next Friday is probably. So, take care. Bye-bye.